The next spot where the ace forward Patrick Kane might touch down is still up in the air, but it seems like a sweet homecoming, a reunion with a strong squad, and a switch to a former foe are all in the mix, dude. Kane is still a free agent and was expected to be out for a four to six months recovery time following hip surgery in the offseason, man. He's still a hot commodity, especially for a playoff run, and Frank Saravalli from the Daily Faceoff spilled the beans that the Buffalo Sabres, Detroit Red Wings, and New York Rangers are all throwing their hat in the ring to sign Kane. Saravalli spilled the tea that the Rangers are keeping an eye on Kane, and he also mentioned that the star has been checking out the Red Wings, bro. This 34-year-old dude is still a powerhouse in the league, racking up 451 goals and 1,237 points over his 16-season career, scoring four All-Star nods, the 2015-16 Hart Trophy, and helping the Chicago Blackhawks bag three Stanley Cups. In the 2022-23 season, he sniped 21 goals and dished out 57 points in 73 games between Chicago and the Rangers. So, if he's looking to add another Stanley Cup to his collection, going back to the Big Apple seems pretty rad. The Rangers snagged 47 wins in 2022-23 and look like they're ready to rock the Eastern Conference. The catch with a return to the Rangers is the salary cap, bro. They've got only $675,085 in cap space. While that might be enough to get Kane to sign up for a one-year deal and set himself up for a chill free agency next summer, the Rangers aren't the top pick for long-term stability, dude. The Red Wings are on the rise, man. They're aiming to step up their game in 2023-24. They haven't made it to the playoffs since 2016, which put an end to their legendary 25-season playoff streak. Detroit has been building up and a slick playmaker like Kane could help their young crew break through in the tough Atlantic division, even if it's a total bummer for Blackhawk fans. Finally, the Sabres might be the most rad option. Kane is a Buffalo native, so wrapping up his career playing in front of his hometown crowd could be pretty gnarly for him. The Sabres have the longest postseason dry spell in the NHL, with 12 seasons on the bench. But they've got a young crew on the rise and could make some noise in the Atlantic, dude. Wherever Kane ends up, it's likely to be a team in the playoff mix, and he could totally light it up down the stretch. So, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more exciting updates, dude.